and welcome back to Piano Secrets. In this video I'm going to teach you how to play River Flows in You by Yuruma and let's get started. The first thing that you should know is that the song is going to outline an A major scale. If you take the second group when we do the flip, that's what the song is going to use and we'll have this. So that's the intro to the song and you can see that we have A, G sharp A, G sharp A, E and then D. A always stays on the top. Now we add the left hand, we'll have an F sharp minor, like this, and a D ninth. And these two chords, they're going to repeat the entire song. So now we could do is play them together with the first note. And the next step will be splitting the three notes against the three on the right hand. Split it again. We take a time there and we go back. That will be the introduction to the song. Now if you want to practice just the left hand you could count and do one, two, three, four, one, Two, three, four. And now the next part will have the same notes, but this time we have a syncopated rhythm. So that means we're going to have this. So it's kind of the same from the beginning, but doing a syncopation on A. That A that is blending together. So, and we'll have the same chords on the left hand F sharp minor, D ninth, but the only thing is we'll go back to the root at the end. To put it together, we could do the same. Uh, we could do the first group, then we have this one. true that uh, slow it doesn't make much sense but you could take uh, this part we did in four parts so that means you could do this at the beginning and finish up on the F sharp second part so we have this A G sharp A let's do up to that point okay then we add the left hand important that you match that together E and E by itself and then we'll play it all together okay and the next part is gonna outline an A major we have this so we have A major to E major and you can see the scale here and then here E major so melody double notes here and double notes here so we could add the left hand now if A major is like this so we could arrange it any way we want that and we'll bring the A here E and we keep C sharp left hand by itself and then together it's gonna match the first three notes again match 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 and match here all together this line will be And we 
have one more that we'll do in this tutorial. So we have now. So our melody now, still working with the same scale. A, G sharp, A. E, A, B, C sharp. C sharp D E and then back to B. So each one's gonna match and your left hand for this is gonna be F sharp minor, D ninth, A major, and E major. Now we could start matching, so matches we go to right, matches again, matches. one more time so so that's what we have other than that I think that uh, you'll be fine and remember that most of the time the matching area is the first three notes when I'll do this by itself together by itself again together together by itself and same here I hope this video was helpful and if you enjoyed it, ring the bell so you can see me on the next video. Thank you very much.